Hey guys, this is Matt for Creative, and today we're looking at a Bumble and Bumble product. This is like my third favorite product to kind of finish off a shower, you know, shampoo, conditioner, and then finally put something in my hair to weigh it down. And this is the Bumble and Bumble Hairdressers Invisible Oil. This is one of my favorite oils just because it is not super heavy. It's, I would consider it lightweight. And when you use it with your hands and play with, you know, your hair with your hands, you don't get that oily residue on your hands. It's just the perfect amount for just being like a usable product. For me, I can take a shower, but if I don't put anything in my hair, my hair gets a little bit frizzy. So I do think I require oil. And for me, it's about maybe two to three pumps. My hair is I need a haircut. I honestly do. It's like fuzzy on the sides. But for me, I'm going to use one, two, and that's it. Like if you have longer hair, you're going to use more, but kind of massage it into my hands. And my hair is damp. Again, just took a shower. I'm going to like massage this in here. And my finishing touch is not something I can do now because it's it's nighttime, but I bike in the city here. So the finishing touch, and wow, the smell. I totally forgot about that smell. It's just like a smooth scent. Uh, my finishing touch is riding my bike kind of, and wind in the hair, and that kind of makes like a messy look because I don't go for a super combed down look, but for me, the oil just adds the perfect amount of weight where it's, my hair is not going to frizz up and it's just going to feel exactly what I need it to feel like. And again, you may see a little bit of a shine, but hands don't feel oily. They feel nice. They feel responsive. And I'm, I'm very happy. I'm kind of curious. What does it say it recommends? It says work sparingly into damp hair before heat styling or through dry hair to finish. And by the way, yes, it's always good where if you do um, use a hair dryer to put oil in it and kind of can counteract some of the damaging effects to hair. So if I do use a uh, hair dryer, it's oil first, whatever, play, and then go on from there. But for me, it's just one of my favorite finishing products um, to use after a shower. All right, guys, if you have any comments or questions, put it in the comments section below. Don't forget I'm on Instagram and threads at M8B9. You can email me at creativenyc2023 at gmail.com. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I will see you next time.